Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to get back missing devices that might not be appearing in the device manager settings on your Windows computer. So this could definitely be a frustrating issue, and in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve it without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump right into it. So first thing we're going to do is open up the magnify glass search icon. So go ahead and left click on that and search for device manager. Best result should come back with device manager here. So go ahead and open that up. So first thing you want to do is go ahead and select the user account up at the top. Just go up to the top bar here. So it says user. In my case, this will be your username. Go ahead and just click on this and then select the action tab. The first thing, once you're in here, select scan for hardware changes. See if the device appears. And that's again after you've plugged it in, make sure it's working properly. If it's not in the list right now, you would go ahead and select action again and select add legacy hardware. Select next. Search for and install the hardware automatically. Select next again. It did not find any hardware, so we're going to go back, select the back button here. And we're going to select install the hardware that I manually select from a list. Then select next. Select which type of device it is. So if it's a camera, for example, you'd select that and then next. So you just go ahead so you can see cameras, display adapters, and there should be imaging devices, for example, and you'd select next. Go ahead and select the one that's applicable for your device. Next again. And that's pretty much it, guys. So then you'd restart your computer, and hopefully I would have been able to resolve your problem. Again, make sure your device is turned on, and if you have it plugged in, unplug and plug it back in again. Just see if that also resolves the problem. So pretty straightforward process, guys. I do hope that I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.